Okay, Rex now. Hey Rex, just checking in. Uh, you think we can get into the Jabber thing? Yo, yeah, yeah. I can get you into that networking dinner. Those guys owe me. As a plus, I'll even explain all the complicated marketing terms to you, because I'm a swell guy. But make it obvious you're not my day. Don't cockblock me, all right? Uh, gross, Major. I roll, Mr. Casanova. I really doubt girls are falling at your feet when they look older than my when you look older than my dad. Okay, and trust me, that weird car you have is not helping. Now's not a good time. All right, I'm trying to get these douches to explain why I showed up to an almost empty hall. My talks used to be a full house kind of deal. So what the hell is this bullshit? I even paid for ads this time. I know I had eyeballs on those. So why isn't it translating into numbers? Oh. Sorry. Okay. Uh, remember my idea? I really think it's going to solve all of that. I think it's going to solve all that for you. Trust me on this. Just give me a call later. Yeah, yeah, fine. This better be good. All of them so far have been like, oh no, we're losing numbers. We're losing followers. Something's happening. This is bad. This is my livelihood. I'm losing it. And then Maya's like, I think I have an idea. I think I know what we can do. Which... Makes me think that maybe she did do one of those, like, rituals where it's like, if you do this, you'll get a wish or whatever. And she did it with her friends, you know? Maybe? Man, I can't believe I joined some girl group. Ah, uh, don't be a spoil sport. I'm only doing this because of you, all right? Nah, thanks for sticking up for me with that nutso group. That's what friends do. Yeah, well, my last so-called friend almost got me locked away for life, that mofo bastard. Okay, maybe they are, like, friends outside of their group, even though... Well, not... They're friends with Maya. It looks like Maya was kind of their, like, holding point, where she knew each of them individually and brought them together. We'll see, we'll see if Mina is like that, too. We'll never do that to you, Rex. Peaky promise. You know, I'll look out for you. Yeah, fine. I'll admit it. It's pretty sweet to have a team that's got my back, all right? Don't get too excited. I'm a lone alpha wolf. I can handle flying solo just fine. But I guess what I'm trying to say is uh, it's, you know, nice. Not everyone's out to screw you over. Anytime, friend. Yo, yo, I looked up your noise issue. I think your old ass gear is just picking up all sorts of interference. Or, you know, it could be aliens. So, you think it's just interference on my speakers? Are those, like, radio waves? Okay, that kind of makes sense. It's just kind of scary to hear voices from nowhere. Yeah. And, no, it's definitely not my meditation chance. <sighs> Guess I'll try cutting out my sleep music then. Also, you followed up on that client deal yet? Oh, right, sorry. A lot of crazy stuff has been happening. Hey, get your head in the game, all right? This isn't some happy, clappy friendship pact or running a business here. Point taking, you can stop nagging now. Man, don't give me that. You're trying to kill off, kill the group off? Oh my god, are you so mad over that ad I did for Patrick? Since you brought it up, yes! You can't do my promo vid, but totally jump on that loser's crap thing? I told you, it just sort of happened. I already apologized. You best remember I don't need any of you, all right? I can drop you tomorrow and be just okay. Wow, uh, go ahead then. The second I get I get something better, bet your ass I will. Uh, Rex vents his frustrations at working with Maya and says he has no issues moving on from the group. Dude, you want some dumbass retreat? Just hit me up soon, all right? Maya, are you just going to keep ignoring me? Just be straight up. You don't have to hide from me. I'm not going to bite. If you can't handle the pressure or this thing's really not working out, let's just hash it out like adults. That was creepy. The, like, background noises. I've got more questions. God, why you gotta use Maya's number? Almost killed me there. Ha, huh, get it? Funny guy, eh? That was in poor taste. That was kind of like, that was in poor taste. Well, can't please everyone. Make it quick, because I got a business to run. So shoot these questions. You sound important. Maya was your business partner. You can give me straight answers. There's no point in asking that. Maya was your business partner. Yeah, with the other two. 
Just four independent adults looking to es escalate their pro pro portfolio to the next level. Got to rethink my workflow now with Maya gone. Figure out a new career plan. Problems keep flying up on me. I thought you said that you would... What problems? What do you do again? What problems? Let me break it down. Less followers equal big problems. Where are we? Uh, where were you when Maya died? Editing my videos. Gotta give my people what they want. Me. But it says here you were reading. There you go, yep. The cops can't record my calls. Can They very well can. I mean, I was reading and editing. I can multitask, so my theory? Maya went on some bullshit detox self-care trip. Whatever she did there messed up her face, and she got so upset and just croaked. Pretty dumb theory, but okay. What kind of detox is she? Uh, how do you know about her facial injuries? Uh, wild guess? That's a real wild guess. My theories tend to be accidentally on point, all right? I'm a visionary. You liar. I know you're playing detective, but let me just say, my being dead means business is bad for everyone, especially me. How is that? Trying to prove you're not a suspect? Always thinking in profits, huh? How is that? Well, for one image is for one image is everything, and death's a bummer for any brand. Okay, time's up. You need anything else? I I've could have I I've, I've could have made seventy eight hundred bucks in these few minutes talking to you. Uh, we'll be in touch. Wrap it up fast, will ya? Okay, find a way to link the video store. That I need. I mean, I'm so scared about going. Jabber's got so much going on. I need to check it out. I don't make excuses, I make money. No, it isn't easy. This life isn't for everyone. So before you think you can do my job, just spare me some wisdom. Don't compare yourself to me, ever. You're not on my level, and you never will be. Who's coined that? That's the T, Mike freaking drop. Yeah, heading yourself there, Lomo. He doesn't make jobs, he makes careers. He isn't a man, he's God. He's not cool, he's a fool. So sorry, my phone and email uh, emails have been acting up recently. Damn carriers, I'm afraid you can only reach me at my part-time job. Who's this? Rex Keegan. Oh, okay, this is this is Rex, right? No, Rex had a different account. Just like this post. Don't you wish you can get paid for just browsing? Answers right here. Contact me, and I can refer you to. Pro okay, maybe if everyone. Can Pay to browse why would we do any other job because it's an elite program not just any idiot can get it um hey that sounds pretty rad hook me up yesterday just shoot me an email i'll give you the deets you demand can't wait for those sweet sweet monies recruits contact rex's new recruit is a user named pumped up clicks they were offering to be a referral to rex's talk and they shared an email address oh i got you Ugh, women. This is why the Get Rex armies are the only real ones. Isn't wasn't that the name of the like troll? Growing stronger by the second two. Tell them, boss, you and your little boys club are gross. Sell out, please. Some of us would rather work than cry and beg for what we have. Jealousy is a terrible disease. Get well soon. Drama. Who do I have to fight for you, queen? <laughs> Interesting, because you were begging here for followers when you came to Jabber. Talk about irony? Yeah, we got an email about that. She was asking for likes. I think it's crumbling. No one ever stays with me in my life. Oh, Mina. I'll always be there for you, Mina. Sorry, people suck. Your life sounds so exhausting. Yeesh, glad I don't have your life. One drop of blood and the sharks are already swimming. We're stronger, get rexed. And none on my watch. Uh, I wish all my problems can be solved with an apology video. Late for work, apology video. Forget your anniversary, apology video. Straight up killed a dude, apology video. Did you do it? If you change your mind, do you apologize for your apology video? Bad in bed, apology video. You just described my life. 
Wish there was an app for that. Touch up, touch someone inappropriately. Apology video. No, stop. What the hell? No. Can I? Let's look at my profile. I did not like that sound. What's the last thing? So it, the last things posted were like a month ago. I understand how people can come up with such vile things to say. I'll blow over Maya. I'll be. I'm here for you when you need me. Why do we hate her again? You're stronger than that. It's not without reason. There are real corners with what you've been posting. And people concerns with what you've been posting. And people are frustrated. That doesn't justify anything. I am with you on that. I wish there was another way. Sorry. Save it. My intention was to inspire people. Sorry if I offended anyone with my posts. Now let's move forward on to more positive things. What did she... Okay, what did she do? If you did offend people, there was no if. Baby, you're inspirational. Don't let them tell you how to behave. Is that all you have to say for yourself? It's okay. At least you know better now. Positivity. What's this? An influencer not milking their controversy? This means nothing without action. I'll reserve judgment till then. Thank you for being the bigger person in this. I'm just glad I sit through a long video or see that ugly notes app people pull out for their apologies. You don't get to decide when people move on, Maya. I've had namaste thrown at me so many times that the meaning is starting to lose me. And we're starting to lose me. Namaste, 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 namaste. I hate all of you. Let me settle this debate once and for all. Pineapple on pizza is good. There we go. That's her. That's where she offended everyone. She said pineapple on pizza is good. Now everyone hates her. Okay. I am. Guys, don't be afraid to go. No way. She probably deleted. The thing is, she probably deleted whatever it was that. Um, that caused the controversy. Ugh. I want to look through everything because I want to make sure I don't miss anything, but... Uh, is she coming in on this? So guess who saved the big influencer context leak before it got deleted? Me. Who knows? I might be in a sharing mood. I need someone's contact. I just DM'd you. Stalking someone? I'll trade you for exclusive news. Anything you want. So talk. Sold. Better be some primo gossip. I have practically offered to bribe hot tea for someone's contact. So that's important. Did I miss any that she replied on that? No. Let's look for... Okay. Okay, so I already looked at that. We're looking... Yeah, we're back like a month... Okay, anti-rex league. Okay, yeah, this is the got got rexed. Um, whatever you do, do not trust this man. His name is Rex Keegan. He is a liar and an all-around fraud. He'll bleed you dry and toss you aside as soon as he gets what he wants. Help us get justice for his victims and get him off Jabber and Chimera by reporting his posts. Whatever Rex did, it affected many people and they all want justice doing god's work i'm surprised he's not losers i'm sure damn me ruined my life it's very misinformation it's against jabber's terms and conditions i'm reporting this why are you defending him this is a witch hunt you have no proof also harassment is another policy violation okay we saw that one uh anything else did i see you before no Okay. Nobody's judging me. Trust you. Most of us are worried about our own progress. I'm there to lift each other up. There's nothing specific there. Nope. Okay. This one, because this picture. Maybe not. Okay. Okay, maybe, maybe, okay, I'll stop for now. Um, let's go check out Chimera, your stories, your pictures. So this is the Instagram. Oh my goodness, okay. We have more to look at. So yeah, this is straight up, like, Instagram. Um, do I go up here? Okay, let me look at my profile. Fitness enthusiast, vegan, flower child. I believe in helping people be their best selves. 100,000 followers. How many followers does she have? Okay, so she she did get 100,000. She didn't just, like, lose them all. 
Um, can't even get a follower or mention after I liked all your posts. Canceled. Okay, I was like, is that someone talking about her? Um, maybe someone on your newest one would talk about her. Oh my friend, you are great. Give come here. Come here, Miles. So yesterday, I can't express my gratitude and appreciation enough. I'm still reeling over the fact that there are so many of you following me. I love each and every one of you so much. You are why I do this. I am nothing without your support. Thank you for choosing to stay with me. I can't wait to see where we'll go next. She hasn't done anything to make it up to us. And you guys reward her with 100K followers. What a joke. What did she do? Tell me. I told you you had nothing to worry about. Let's get you to 200K, 200K next. You could give back and do a giveaway. JK, LOL. Or am I? Been charging my healing crystal every morning with empowering affirmations to protect you. And I'm so glad it worked. Now nah, you're still canceled. Bye. I love you so much, Maya. You know that, but I hate that I didn't say it enough when, when I could. You are my better half. Rest in peace, Maya. I'm so sorry. I can't believe she's gone. These are not tears of sorrow or remorse. Oh, it can't be happening. Okay, yeah, everybody, this is what everybody is saying. Everyone has learned that. Oh, so now that she's dead, all you haters can suddenly express grief and empathy. GTFO, my best friend's page. Okay, so where do people talk about? She really doesn't have a lot on Instagram. Or maybe just unable to load previous posts. Hey guys, I actually wanted to share this with you today. It's a little bit embarrassing, but I do want to be honest about how I used to look like. This is a photo of me from a couple years ago. I know, right? But the person that you see in front of you right now is a direct result of a good change in diet and a healthy lifestyle. I just want you to remember to maintain that positive mindset. And remember, you can do it too. Oh, did she? Oh, damn, I would not follow old you. Oh, that's mean. I'm going to say, did she get canceled because she... Because that's not really... Ah. Uh... It's it's it, it gives off the impression that like you're doing it all for looks or that you should do it all for appearance, you know, just saying like this is what I used to look like. Now look how great I look. And it should be more about health and how you feel rather than, you know, how you're quote unquote supposed to look, you know? So I could see that getting her in trouble. I get a lot of messages about how perfect my life is because people mistake my Camara post for real life. It took a lot of energy for me to get here. So I just want to keep it real for all you guys and let you know that you can get here too. Take that photo in a time space rip. What is the background warp? warp? It's like a filter, duh. A filter of fake totes of Photoshop job and a bad one of that. You're right. What the hell, Maya? This isn't vegan behavior. Is she really faking being fat? Don't know which is worse. This, your damaging cleanses or the doctors don't know things post. Woof. Okay. That's, uh, that's a lot there. What's embarrassing is you trying to pass this off. What were you thinking? I just struggled with my weight and was bullied for it. Screw you. Help, helped you Photoshop this? So, okay. It, hey wasn't, guys, it wasn't just the... Oh. I actually wanted to share this with you today. It's a little bit embarrassing, but I do want to be honest about how I used to look like. This is a photo of me from a couple years ago. I know, right? But the person that you see in front of you... It's really blurry in the background, but I could totally see that. But I guess maybe that's what the drama was about. So freaking... So good at the freaking gym. Cleanse two. Cleanses... Uh, FYI, cleanses are not good. If you do research on it, you'll see that it's really really bad <laughs> they are not healthy for you any of the ones that at least are like full liquid cleanses at least i've heard i mean again like i said before do your research on this stuff i'm just throwing this out here because it's one of the examples of something that i've heard i did like not a liquid cleanse there's a smoothie cleanse at one point and then i much later down the line learned hey that's actually not very healthy for you <laughs> I was like, oh, okay. Okay, what's the fan? Usually not a fan of gym selfies since I actually come here to work out, but I just wanted to share my amazing cleanse journey. 
It's about her routines at Mind Fitness Body. Yeah, there was the one person I never said that. You're misinterpreting my words. Here's Miss Anti-Vax with another home remedy. Watch her monetize the recipe she got off the web next. Uh, anytime I feel like sleeping and skipping my morning routine, I just pack my mat and take it outdoors. Okay, this seems... About your cleanse routine has wrecked people up. Mike's not responsible with what people do with her content. She is. Remember this post where she literally said doctors don't know anything? Her whole juicing thing was a gateway to my sister's eating disorder. She needs to be accountable for a post. Oh. I'm sorry about your sister. That's awful. Vegan really changed my life. Oh, yeah. Weren't you going on about wanting a big greasy bur burger because all the rabbit f rabbit food's getting to you? I said no such thing. But she did She did say she posted, like, a picture. That's right. She said she posted a picture about eating a burger. You can't call yourself a vegan if you think about eating animal products so that could be another it looks like there's maybe what what was the specific catalyst though like i feel like there was probably like a specific there's usually like one specific thing that kind of sets off all of the like loss in followers and stuff and when that happens that's when people bring up like all the other things that or maybe less of a catalyst, but add to it. You know what I mean? I don't know. But it does seem like there's multiple things. But what was the one thing that caused her to start losing followers at that one point where she said that she was struggling with that? Anything? Okay. Okay. I love how detailed these games are, but at the same time, I'm also just like, Ugh. there's so much info here. I'm not sure what's important and what's not. Okay, let's get back to, let's talk to Mina or see what she said and then talk to her. Mina, I'm so sorry for replying so late. So I thought about it and I'm in. You'll be my first ever client. So yeah, she said she's a manager. Uh, first thing, I'm signing you on for an awesome group boosting service. You're going to be a star. Oh my god, I'm so excited! Thank you so much for officially being my manager. I feel like the real deal now. I'll follow all of your advice. You're gonna be like, my sensei! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. See you next week. Um, Maya? Like, it might be a tech issue, but a song I uploaded got removed. I removed it. What? Why? Until you get a hang of managing your brand, everything goes through me first, okay? This isn't fair. You don't, like, own me, okay? Mina, I did it for your own good. You're giving me so much anxiety right now. Stop trying to control me. I'm not your pupper. Puppet. Okay, just relax, and you'll see I'm right soon. It's all going to pay off. No, I don't believe this. I hate you. You're horrible. <coughs> oh, Mina spat with Maya. Everybody has spat with her, but, you know, that happens in life. Mina calls out Maya's overbearing behavior and expresses her hatred for Maya. Y'all pretty harsh with it, I will say that. Like, just, I hate you. Like, that eh, doesn't look too good. Can't wait till I get a real manager and then I don't have to follow, to, like, follow your stupid instructions. It's not like you're doing so great yourself right now, too. I mean, honestly, once you get a quote-unquote real manager, you probably would get even more control, but... I don't know. Um, Maya, I'm sorry. That was really mean. I shouldn't have said that. I just get, like, really emotional because, like, I totally care about what you think. Please don't hate me. I got it! I got it! I got it! Did I say I got it? Thank you so much, Maya. Your advice really worked. The last time I auditioned, they kept telling me I got the talent but lacked the X Factor. Like... What does that even mean? <laughs> but who cares? I did what you said and they booked me on the spot. I'm scheduled for next month. So please come, okay? That's fantastic. Told you I was right about the branding. Um, Maya, 
Can you try talking to Arya and Rex to get off my back and let me do my own thing? Like, just let me breathe? I feel like they're just so... so condescending all the time. It's like... It's like really tiring to deal with. I mean, I, I know they're older than me and stuff, but I'm not a kid, okay? Sai, Mina, you really need to learn how to stand up for yourself. I can't fight all your battles for you. I know. And anyway, they mean well. We don't want you making the same mistakes we did. Better hearing it from us than others, right? I guess so. I gotta be, like, gotta, like, be more assertive. I'll try. That's the spirit. Oh, by the way, your last post? I'm not crazy about that picture. You can change it to something a bit more edgy. You look away from the camera and scowl or something. Um, okay. Oh no, Mina, I'm so sorry. I completely blanked and forgot about tonight. Did the show go okay? <sighs> I've been dropping the ball on everything. I've just been so tired, you know? I feel like I've been seeing... Never mind. I'll make it up to you soon, okay? It's okay, you were here with me in spirit. Um, Maya, so I tried something new on Chimera. Uh, let me know if it's okay. Maya, everything okay? Are you like doing a gray rock on me right now? Fine, I'm so sorry you know I didn't mean that. Hope you like, you're like all right. Hi Maya. Um, are you ignoring me or something? D did, did I do something wrong to annoy you? I feel like I haven't seen you in so long. You're not leaving us, are you? It's just that you're the best at keeping the gang going. And I need you to be around. Together. All right, let's grill her. I've got more questions. Is this an interview? I'm investigating this on my own. Her death must have been a shock. Just trying to figure out what happened. Let's let's empathize with her because she seems to be the most like emotional about it and the most like scared to talk. So let's empathize with her. Her death must have been a shock. I'm totally heartbroken. I can't help thinking like I could have helped her somehow. It's so sad that she died alone. There's nothing you could have done. She was a close friend. How are you coping? No, I I wanted to ask how you think you could have helped, but are you coping? She was a close friend. There was nothing I could have done. Let's ask she was a close friend. She was my manager. But we were friends too. She believed in me from the start, you know? I was struggling to get anyone to listen to me, but she heard me. She helped me change my look and made me who I am today. Sounds like you were a lot. You look different before? Not struggling anymore? Not struggling anymore? Kind of yes and no. It's always like a struggle, you know? Your follower numbers matter more than talent. Even Maya got worried when she lost followers. All this stress must have eaten her up inside. She still shows sort of trouble. Where were you when she died? Uh, where were you? Just rehearsing for my gig. I should have made more effort to contact her. Does rehearsing include writing? Yes, sometimes. Um, I mean, writing rehearsals, rehearsing, it's all part of the process. I'm just so overwhelmed right now. I totally lost track of someone I cared about. I kept thinking about how she died. I keep thinking, like, how, what if no one reported her death? If that random cop didn't call the cops, would anyone have found her? How do you know about the anonymous caller? Um, I heard the cops talking about it. It's a lie. Yeah. Makes sense. I must have overheard. So, can I go now, please? All this Maya talk is really triggering me right now. I need some time alone. Uh, you've been great help. Okay, bye. New post on uh, Chimera. You guys. Thank you so much for coming out to my show tonight. I really felt the love. Some 
sometimes the pain is so raw I can't even find words Maya Maya was my guiding light Without her I'm just groping around in darkness you know It's like death just stalks me everywhere I go like I have to keep crashing into tides of suffering For you guys Tonight it was just me pouring myself into the music and I know that's what she would have wanted Feel like a moth flying wild and blind rest in peace my your light is always in my heart this was so moving, I guess she would want you to carry on. Oof. No, no. No, go, no, go. Okay, what about trolls being here at you? No, I don't care. Don't you deserve loyal admirers instead of persistent haters? No, I don't. Just spare us a minute as we reshape your reality. No, get me out of here. Get, no, okay. Take these questions to see how you like your reality to be shaped into. Just leave me alone. I don't want this. Which image best describes how you see yourself now? I... I have what? I the background is creepy. <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, not the bottom two, one of the top two, I guess. It, 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 that I guess, whatever. Okay. Oh, what would your journey to the top feel like? Um. Um, uh, this colorful and fun. I don't know. What do you seek the most? Uh, what? C colors, art, I don't know. Uh, what would you change about yourself? What do these mean? Um,. This, I don't know, I hate drowning. Drowning's terrifying. Oh gosh. What are you willing to become? None of these! These are all creepy! Uh, this one, because it's the least creepy, I guess. Okay. Back off. Back off! I want none of this. Idol? I got the achievement idol. You are charm personified. When you talk, people listen. Others desire to rise to your level, so your challenge lies in relating to your audience without intimidating them. This is so not true. Strengthen your perfection by projecting the, projecting the facade that you are just like everyone else. I don't pretend to be like everyone else. I am not at all like anyone else. Okay, can I get out, please? What? Okay, get out. Idol. Four files. What? What? Okay. Oh, group chat thread we discovered. But what was what was this? Have you guys got tickets to my show yet? I promise that it's been worth it. Practicing nonstop. Um, no, go back to Chimera because there's another new post. Uh, grief is the price you pay for love. It's the same um, poet as the that that uh, that their group name came from. It's the world because my best friend took it. She was the closest thing I had to her sister. She will be missed. Rest in peace, Maya. TRM. 
TRM. That was what was at the top of the, the idol card. Used to be a huge bully. Maybe I still am. I think that I liked the power, people fearing me. Although that was short-lived because my nerd for affection was greater. My tragic story? Don't have one. I was just lonely. Didn't know how to make friends or interact with people. I had a lot of anger as a result. It didn't get better when I grew up. Ended pushing people away even more. That's when I came across this page. Introduced me to the community I was looking for all my life. Florence Bell, Aries Rising. I like the power. People fear me. Who ever does good drinks? Hey, it's the hey there. Whoever her new friends are, good luck. Also, run. Run very far. What? Missing chat thread. Karma's bigger bitch than you were, it seems. No, what's this? TRM. Can I go? Aries Rising? No, it's not letting me go anywhere. Okay. Okay. Don't you kids like, okay, uh. I spoke to them individually. Or anything new? Uh, something doesn't add up. I have no idea what to think. Meh, nothing much. Uh. Something doesn't add up. That sounds promising. What do you have? They claim to have alibis. They knew details of the crime scene. What? All we told the public is Maya died of unknown causes, nothing else. What did they tell you? Mina knew the ominous color. Rex said something about her face being injured. I'm going to go with that one just because, like, only we know about those marks. I, I still don't know about the anonymous color, like, at all. Either information leaked or he knows something we don't. Uncover any other info? Okay. Oh, man, I hate that I missed... Aside from the department, only an emergency dispatcher would know about this, or the caller themselves. Okay, what else? What's your take? I why didn't I ask? They could have been there. There might be a leak in the force. They could have been there. It's possible. But if they're lying, we have to prove it. You're sure that's all you have so far? They claim to have alibis. So you ask about their whereabouts, eh? Good job. What did they say? Let me start with Rex again. Was I in a video when Maya died? Sure he was. Tell me I have more intel. Mina was rehearsing for a gig when Maya died. I'm sorry, I missed Arya's completely. Got anything else? Hold on. You thinking what I'm thinking? Their alibis are pretty weak. They're all working. Their alibis are pretty weak. Weaker than a station's damn coffee than the station's damn coffee. I don't buy it for a second. You got something here, but we need more. What else did you dig up? What else can we pursue? They all told me similar stories. I got I got a theory. I'll spit it out. They are intentionally withholding information. I smell a cover up. They all murdered Maya. They're intentionally withholding information. I believe so too. They must have seen or heard something. Whatever happened to Maya spooked them enough to stay mum. Might just be an accident. They must be conspiring. It might... I don't think that they're conspiring. It might just be an accident. But... I... No, because... Even if they're just withholding information, they could be conspiring, but it doesn't necessarily mean that... But I hate that it's, they must be conspiring. Uh, but, I don't know, saying it might just be an accident is also really weak. Let's go with conspiring. I'm gonna, I, I've been so, I've been so, like, chill with this. I need to be more upfront. They shouldn't be keeping things from us. We need solid evidence to nail them. I tried getting her laptop myself, but the chief switched the locks to the evidence room. If you don't find a way to access Maya's laptop remotely, the trail ends here. So that's my next thing, is I need to do that. But I think I'm going to end the episode here. Um, 
I might want to also keep an eye out like for the hints just because I keep missing stuff. But on that note, remember to shine your light in every world. Bye.